Hello, hello everyone! Welcome back to the channel. Today, I want you to feel like you're in a career development session. We'll discover together how do you feel so far about your career development. So let's start. First of all, I want you to ask yourself two questions. The first one, how do you feel right now about your career development? And the second one, what are your thoughts right now about your career development? This is a satisfaction quiz to let you know how do you feel about yourself. And right now, let's see if your thoughts are true or not through these steps. Step number one, you can start by writing down your goals that you've planned for this year or you were planning in the previous four or five years. Step number two, you can choose a phrase with each goal that explains if you achieve this goal, you will be this adjective. For example, you can say, if I finish this communication course, I'll be a better communicator with my colleagues. Step number three, in addition to the phrases, you can describe yourself professionally with words like accessible, caring, engaging, or active. I'm putting these examples on the screen so you can take a screenshot and choose what suits you. So now, after you've discovered yourself professionally, it's time to see where you are in your career development. And this cannot be done by yourself. You need help from your family, your colleagues, and even your manager. What's better than a manager seeing his or her employee seeking career development? So now, prepare two papers for each one of the people around you and two papers for yourself. Write on the first one the phrases and adjectives we've discovered earlier and on the second one draw three circles. Exceed, meet, adjust. Here comes step number five. Now it's time to fill the circles with the words and phrases you've written. You and the people that are helping you need to put the phrases and the words in the circles. For example, you've written that you are a caring person. If you care too much, they will put it in the exceed circle. If you're perfect the way you are, they will put it in the meet circle. If you need to care a little bit more, they will put it in the adjust circle. You need to get answers at least from five different people. Now we've reached the final step. Go and find out the common answers and put them on a paper that has the same circles we've talked about. And here you go. The meet circle is where you are now. And don't forget that you have two other circles to work on. What are you waiting for? Go now and discover your career development. That's all for now. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you've enjoyed the episode. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, and click the bell icon to get new videos updates. Thank you so much for watching again and see you next time. Bye.